Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration reading for the Pisces Sun, Moon, Horizon sign. It's the second week of October. Love you, Pisces. Thank you for being back. Please um, like, share these videos, and also um, cross, watch, and go listen to the Moon Energy Vibration because that's going to help you guys for the next um, two weeks. Okay, so let's see what's coming up for the Pisces. You have a situation, a karmatic situation. For some of you it's health problems for some of you you're growing out of a situation a situation is becoming much better for you okay there is a block with a situation I don't know this block keep on coming up um, so um, the week begins from the 8th week begins from the 8th until the 24th uh, the 14th <laughs> Eight to the fourteen. The week begins from the eight to the fourteen. So let's see what is happening for you. Okay, you have the King of Wands, which is just a messy person. This person is just very sick, and this person is trying to work with others. So be careful of this person. The Ace of Pentacles. So this person is paying a lot of money. A bloody idiot. Heartbreak and then um, you have the five of rods there is conflicts with this person and then you're looking and seeing a situation and then you have the eye princess okay so what is happening here is that uh, um, there is an happy outcomes to a situation especially with your financial stability all right whoever this king of rods is get away from this person this person is just basically there is so much conflicts that is going on and this person is trying to create conflicts in your life okay um, um, this verse is coming up in the week and this is a man that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius now you could be working with this person or it has to do with some financial stability where this person is trying to block it but it's not going to happen um, the, the 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 three the three of arts the swords um, the um, this is a loss of uh, money we're going to be looking at that now there's going to be some conflicts in the week and you have to look um, in um, this conflicts and the energy of the eye princess is here so what is happening is that the weekend is a weekend that you have to really look at a situation some heartbreaks is going to be coming up okay you have the Empress in the reverse now what is happening is that whoever this um, the rod the the, the um, this man is so, um, it's a very sick person um, and the people who are working together with him they're they're, they're crazy they're very sick they're crazy as people um, very sick people deceitful people it has to do with your financial situation and here you're working hard to bring your financial stability in balance and you know the outcomes is a happy family life where there's going to be positive energies that is coming up it's as if um, your some news is going to be coming and some news could be coming in from the Queen of Pentacles so, so that could be a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and um, listen to your intuition about this person um, you know there is is as if there is a block with this person but we're going to be seeing what is coming out let's see what is the situation that is happening some good news is going to be coming in um, whatever the conflicts is you're going to be seeing the truth of the situation and you're going to be working this out the six of pentacles is in reverse okay so um the eye princess comes up listen to um your situation about family situation okay um whatever is going on listen to your situation about a family situation okay because the three of swords is here on thursday so you you could be receiving an, a message from someone because these two sixes because sixes is all about you balancing out your materialistic stability but whoever this king of 
of Rod is is not a very nice person because there is some conflicts and that sort of a thing you have the energy of the three of Pentacles whoever these people are um, don't put your your trust in family okay D don't and this is kind of crazy to hear but don't put your trust in family because what is here happening you have to listen to your own intuition over a situation um, some of you who are in a relationship with the Queen of Pentacles listen to yourself about the situation okay I'm seeing whatever blockage there is some blockage that is coming up over your financial situation and we're going to be looking to align to see um, what that blockage is, is about but obviously as uh, someone who is uh, an Aries Leo or Sagittarius wants to block your financial situation okay um, let's see what is happening here um, there's an organization that is trying to steal something and block you and it has to do with the Knight of uh, um, Pentacles that is uh, or it could be a woman or it could be a man but there is an offer that is going to be coming in for you and money is going to be coming so whatever and whoever is trying to block your situation this has to do with the Knight of Wands okay whoever this Knight of Wands is get to the bottom of it and get your life back is as if this person wants to um, um, devour your life and that sort of a thing no one has the right to play um, rules over someone else's life so whoever this person is and whatever is going on um, basically just block this person um, from you okay because this person is very very sick because what I'm seeing here whenever the eye princess and the air may come in there are some secrets secrets things that are going to be coming out that is going to be breaking your heart and it could be someone telling you something but not to worry because there is some offer that is about to come in for for you there is there is really some offer that is about to come in do not put trust in your family be careful about your family there is someone very deceptive in your family and there are some secrets okay so don't trust your family whatever you're doing hold your family if you're living um, with family members there's a family member that is very very deceitful okay believe in yourself because as you believe in yourself you're going to be finding out that there is just so much powerful energies that is going to be coming in because you believe in yourself and if you don't believe in yourself no one else will believe in yourself seeing yourself doing well and you will okay because whatever the situation is here is that this night of, of ones whoever this night is is a very sick person this person is really sick and there's a family member do not trust this person um, for whatever it is don't trust this person it's better to get away from this person because this person is not really being honest and here is a secret that this person is carrying there is a secret that this person is carrying and it's all about money okay if if you should win the lottery or if you are about to get some money walk away from this person you know just walk away from this person it could be a child it could be kids that is very deceptive and um, it's amazing but kids can be you know they when they're babies they're so cute but when they grow up and become an adult they can be so really disgustingly horrible um, they can really do deceptive things okay whatever it is um, some um, either your partner or someone is going to be financial stable they're also going to get an offer and whatever you do if you can get away from your kids if you um, can really get away from your kids and get away from where you're living now it's going to be very very positive because here it is your financial stability and the family for some of you it's going to be very good but as if your kids are draining you of your financial situation listen to a situation about your financial situation whoever is partner up with a, an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius there's a lot of conflict conflicts about your financial stability and whoever this person is um, get um, align with who this person is let them know that um, they can't 
whatever they do they can't block you from anything because what is happening is that this person has been blocking you okay the five of swords there's a conflict with the organization and a blockage that is set here and this person is trying to block you some good news is going to be coming in for you guys I'm seeing the energy of the six of ones so some good news is going to be coming in some of you could be receiving some new um, projects or some new connection and that sort of a thing the help that was supposed to be coming in is not coming in anymore so um, you have to align yourself with this and know that you will survive and you will come through whatever the situation that is happening okay someone is going to be coming forward to help you out of your financial situation and this could be someone who is um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn okay whoever you are out there do not um, uh, th this message is for someone is either your kids is in the house living with you or whatever don't trust these kids um, is a very deceptive person um, this person is a, is a scorpion very deceptive person um, so it could be that you have a, 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 a scorpion kid and this is a very deceptive person have nothing to do with this person if you can okay because this person is not being very very honest about anything in his or her life okay so be um, aligned with this that this person only um, wants money be careful um, of this person um, they're very deceptive and it's, it's kind of sad but it's your kid and this is what is happening um, it's all about money for your kid they will do anything for money and it's better to separate yourself from your kid and um, it's, it's really better to separate yourself from your kid because this is not going to be working out if you want to move forward in your life um, release yourself from your kid okay this person is being very deceptive um, it could be a step kid or it could be um, a tinder kid remove yourself from this person is very deceptive whatever he's trying to do or whatever he's trying to align himself with us all about money get away from this person someone is going to be coming in and offering you help and support and open up yourself for this energy I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back remember to cross read whoever is the scorpion kid that you're dealing with this person is now an adult an older person release yourself from them because they're very deceptive they're not really honest okay namaste until next week yeah.